I have yet to find a wrestling fan who doesn't like the Royal Rumble. It's the best show of the year, in my opinion. I love the Royal Rumble match concepts, and we've dove deep into it already. We've done an in-depth video looking at the Royal Rumble 2022 surprises, and we even did a cheeky little video asking if The Fiend, Bray Wyatt, would be in the Rumble match. So make sure you go and check those videos out. But this is Royal Rumble Predictions. And before we get started, please make sure to share the video so your friends can come and have their say. Like the video to help it in YouTube's weird algorithm. And if you are new to the channel, make sure you give us a subscribe too. I do need to say though, before we begin, I honestly think this is one of the most unpredictable premium live event pay-per-views whatever you want to call it from wwe in ages we kick right off with the women's royal rumble match this is so unpredictable there's so many people who could win this match great to see the legends returning obviously mickey james the impact knockouts world champion is in the match great to see her Get a final moment in WWE if this is that. And it's a cool moment as that. That's what she deserves. The Royal Rumble hub of Peacock shows Alexa Bliss prominent. Could she be the winner? There is a lot of talk about Alexa not being in the Rumble match. No idea if that's true. We'll only find out next Saturday. So time will tell. Hopefully Alexa's at least in the match. You know me. I definitely want Liv Morgan to win. However, I don't think she's going to. I wouldn't be shocked if there was a big swerve here. I wouldn't be shocked if Lita was able to pick up the big Royal Rumble win. I feel like with a career she's had, she could des definitely deserve it. Someone like Shotzi stands an outside chance. I think storyline-wise, we're going to go with Bianca Belair. Because her and Becky Lynch, if you don't have Ronda Rousey returning... I think you give it to Bianca for that WrestleMania main event. But if Ronda returns, I think Ronda Rousey. It's the It Couple versus the Grit Couple. I'm really interested in this. This storyline on Raw has been really good. I've actually enjoyed it. It's like a guilty pleasure. I don't think that Edge is losing this. I think he's going to build up momentum heading towards whatever he's got planned at WrestleMania. So... For that reason, I'd say Edge and Beth Phoenix, the grit couple, win at the Royal Rumble. Now, another one that's totally unpredictable. Roman Reigns versus Seth Rollins for the Universal Championship. Now, we know Seth was meant to win the WWE title. Obviously, Brock Lesnar got that title. He was rumoured to beat Roman at day one. If that's going full circle, could we see Brock retain and Seth win this title to get to the same results just with the same title? Seth has said already that he'll change the title back to red and take it to raw. So potentially they've already got a way to do it. It's really interesting. I don't know if they're going to end Roman Reigns' reign yet, but oh, I've got to give a prediction. So my prediction is a new... Universal Champion, I'm going to go with Seth Rollins, the Drip God. Seth's going to win it. <laughs> Becky Lynch defends the Raw Women's Championship against Dewdrop. I, I, I'm interested in this. I want to see what Dewdrop does on the big main event stage. But I don't think she's winning. I think this match is Becky Lynch's. I think it's a way to put Dewdrop over on TV. At the same time as, you know, let Becky Lynch have another victory over someone else. I think Becky's 100% retaining this title. <laughs> Brock Lesnar, Bobby Lashley, WWE Championship. A literal dream match that I honestly thought WWE would never do. I've loved the promo packages, the videos, the hype for this. We got a weigh-in on Raw. That's going to be exciting. See how WWE present that. Honestly, I wouldn't be shocked of a swerve if Lashley was to win the title. Brock could head to the Rumble for sure. But I don't know. Something tells me that R Brock's going to retain. 
I don't know. I, I just I just don't know. I don't see Lashley being the champ heading towards Mania. That's the only thing that's doubting me right now. So I'm going to go out on a limb and I'm going to say Brock Lesnar retain. Honestly, I think if Brock retains, Roman's not going to. If Roman retains, I don't think Brock's going to. I don't see WWE doing champion versus champion. So it's a tough one, but I'm going to go with Brock Lesnar retaining the title belt. The Men's Royal Rumble match. Now, although there's no legends or anything announced for this match, we have got Johnny Knoxville announced. Now, the interesting thing there is we've seen this story play out with Sami Zayn on SmackDown. You can pretty much guarantee something is going to happen. Something weird and funny is probably going to happen. We know Kofi Kingston's in the match, so we're probably guaranteed one of those famous Kofi Kingston Rumble saves. Going to be interesting. Going to be interesting as well how tag teams like Street Profits and the Mysterios work together. I'm going to go out and say, though, I think the winner of this match is going to be whichever champion loses their championship. So Roman Reigns or Brock Lesnar. Now, if both of those retain, living in fantasy lands, I do think one of them is going to lose. If one of them retain, I wouldn't mind an AJ Styles victory. I also wouldn't mind a Big E victory, but outside, outside chance, why not give it to Austin Theory? You expect someone like Austin Theory to lose this kind of match, but get a good run. Why not just have him win it and headline WrestleMania? But you see, this is the issue because I do see Roman versus Brock being the big main event at Mania. But then if you don't have a champion versus champion, you could give it to Austin Theory. Now, just some things to keep an eye open for for the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Now, if you might have seen this if you're on Twitter, of course, Adam Pearce has teased maybe a return to the ring. He could potentially enter the Royal Rumble match. Be interesting as he postman Pearce lace up the boots. And of course, I wanted to dive deep into the actual bookies odds on who the bookies say are going to win. Now, for the women's, they predict... Bianca Belair will win. And for the men's, they predict Big E and Brock Lesnar. Basically tied at the time of recording this video. So these bookies odds will change 100%. On Raw, they'll change. They'll change multiple times throughout the week. Take them with a grain of salt. But at the time of recording, they are the favourites to win the Royal Rumble match. So what's going to happen only time will tell. Let me know your thoughts and your predictions in the comment section down below. Like the video, share the video, and if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Follow me on Twitter at C Wrestling UK, and I'll see you as always next time. Peace!